I'm Joe Kirshner with American Water College. Watch as I use my five-step approach to solve this problem. For velocity and flow rate problems, we're going to use the formula that says Q or flow rate is equal to the area times the velocity. Typical units for Q are cubic feet per second, MGD, and gallons per minute. The area is in square feet. And notice the diameter is typically what we're given, and they give it to us in inches. So we need to take that diameter in inches, divide it by 12 to get the diameter in feet. And to calculate this cross-sectional area, some people like to use the pi r squared formula. But since we're given the diameter and not the radius, to avoid confusion, I recommend that you use the formula 0.785 times the diameter squared. So we'll work these problems using 0.785 times diameter times diameter. And then the velocity is given in feet per second. So what we're typically trying to find in these problems is what is the flow velocity in feet per second? And that means that we're going to rearrange this formula to solve for velocity. This first problem reads, calculate the flow velocity of water flowing at a rate of three cubic feet per second when the cross-sectional area of the pipe is 0.785 square feet. Well, they were kind to us in this problem when they gave us the cross-sectional area, so we don't have to calculate it. But they want us to find the flow velocity in feet per second. Our flow is three cubic feet per second, and then our cross-sectional area is 0.785 square feet. So with that, we can take our formula that says flow rate equals area times velocity. And we know that we're looking for velocity. So we'll move on to step three, where we rearrange the formula. So the flow rate divided by the area will equal the velocity. Well, before we plug these numbers in, well, it, actually, it's all done for us. So we simply plug those numbers in in step four. Three cubic feet per second divided by 0.785 square feet gives us 3.8 feet per second. If you need additional help preparing for a state license exam, click the link below and we'll get you some more information about our license-specific exam prep courses.